Hello, and welcome back to my playthrough of Morrowind. So, I'm looking for someone. I am looking for Vex High Priest Sayoni. You're not going to tell me about Sayoni, are you? No. I will listen, Outlander, but make it quick. What do you want? Oh. Ah, wait, no, 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 I want to check up here, don't I? This is the actual temple, so they've got to be in here somewhere. Is there something you need? It's locked. Okay. No, is there no. I Can you tell me where Sayoni is now? Yes, Outlander. What do you want? Hmm. Okay. High Priest Sayoni demand to speak with the false god Vivek. So where is Sayoni? Uh, do I have a bounty? That's a good question. Before I speak to him. Nope, no bounty. Okay. Hmm. Hall of Justice, then, maybe? May I help you? What do you think of our city? Nope. What have we got over here? Go ahead, Outlander. What do you need? I don't need. Go ahead, Outlander. What do you need? Everyone loves me. May I Is help there you? There's something I can do for you. No, thank you. All right. Let's try further on down. I should have known those went into each other, but. Hall of Wisdom. What Excuse me, Mr. Ordinator. Me, uh, okay. So those look just like quarters. Has to be somewhere in here. It's the library. What do you think of our city, Outlander? Go ahead, Outlander. What do you need? What is my personality score? It can't be that high. 30. But everybody loves me. Very strange, very strange. Definitely not in here. What do you think? It's the Hall of Justice. Let's try up here. It's the High Fane. You know what? Something you need. Uh, thank you for coming, Shits and Trees. You know the Temple Doctrine on the Neverine. Perhaps it's time to change that doctrine. Temple Doctrine. Uh, the Temple must protect people from false doctrines, and your association with the Imperial Intelligence makes your motivations and integrity suspect. But you have been chosen horse tour by the ne uh, Neverine by the Dumma people, and, uh, and we have reached a crisis with Dagotha. We can no longer def uh, defend the people against the Awakened Sixth House. You and your prophecies may represent our last hope. 
the situation is very desperate but I would rather you hear the details of our situation and the circumstances leading up to that situation from Lord Vivek himself. He has asked to see you. Would you agree to a private meeting with him and hear in person what he has to say? Yes, I'll meet Vivek. I helped him save the city, do you know? Good, here are two keys, one for the private back entrance to my quarters, the other to a locked entrance to Lord Vivek's palace. I regret that, at present, the ordinators are not completely under my control, so for now I'll ask you to avoid confrontation with them. Lord Vivek is expecting you, his lordship is remarkably patient, but perhaps it would be better not to keep him waiting. Okay. What do you think of our city? Ah! Right, um, it's very dark. What is it? I can't see where I'm going or what I'm doing. Um, let's... 11 p.m. Let's... Eight hours? Yeah, let's wait eight hours. There we go. I can see roughly what I'm doing now. Uh, seems to be a little brighter on the uh, recording, though, which is... <laughs> nice. For you lot. <laughs> Okie dokie. Let's go speak to uh, Master Vivek. Hey dude, remember me? Uh, I expected you, we have business you and I. Uh, when I was young like you, I was very impatient, so I kept our business, so I will keep our business short. Then, later, there may be time for other things. First, I propose to remove my curse upon the Nereverine, end the persecution of the distant priests, and proclaim all Morrowind that Shits and Trees is the incarnate of ne Neverine, the prophesied saviour of Morrowind, and the last hope to withstand the menace of Dagoth in the Sixth House. These things I will do whether you wish or not. Next, I propose to surrender to you the power and responsibility for defeating Dagoth You may choose to refuse, I will not compel you. You will receive uh, the power as a gift in the form of an artifact called Wraithguard. Uh, you may accept the gift, then you uh, do it. Uh, then do with it as you will. You will receive the responsibility as an oath. You may give your oath, then keep it or break it as you like. First, will you accept Wraithguard as a gift? Yes, I will accept Wraithguard. Good, sensible of you. And now, I, uh, and now will give you. Uh, now, will you? Will you give your oath? before all gods and men, before all spirits, visible and invisible, before my honour and your honour, to dedicate yourself and Wraithguard to, defeat the, and, to the defeat and destruction of Dagoth Earth and the preservation of Morrowind and its peoples. Yes, I so swear. Uh, not very sensible, but very good. I was hoping for someone who would have no hesitations about making such an oath. Uh, you will now have a brief mom uh, momentary sensation of time passing. Don't be alarmed. You are being taken out of time in order to avoid the unpleasant experience of learning how to use Wraithguard. It will be over before there is a brief sensation of motion in total darkness floating, but without a sense of weight or direction. You know it. Now, I will mo- uh, uh, It will be over before you know it. Now, I will notify the temple that you are our champion. There will be no more persecution of the distant priests, and I hope both sides will move, uh, will, shall swiftly be reconciled. We have time for questions if you like, or you may leave as you wish, but I think there are at least two things you ought to know before you leave. How to use Wraithguard, how to defeat Dagoth Earth. Uh, use, defeat Dagoth Earth. To defeat Dagoth Earth, go up Red Mountain to recover the artifact, uh, artifact hammer, Sunder, from the Gates Citadel, Verminal, and then recover the artifact blade, Keening, from the Gates Citadel, of Drosel, then proceed with Wraithguard, Sunder and Keen to the Citadel of Dagoth Earth. Within the Citadel, find the Heart of Lorcan and use the three artifacts to sever Dagoth Earth's connection to the Heart and he will be destroyed, and the Blight End or Morrowind. To destroy Dagoth Earth, you must sever his connection with the Heart of Lorcan. To do this, strike the Heart with the Artifact Hammer Sunder once, then strike the Heart more than once with the Artifact Blade Keening. Uh, you must wear Wraithguard because you cannot handle either Sunder or Keening unless you are wearing Wraithguard. That is the short, simple explanation. Here is the long, detailed explanation written down for your convenience. Read it, study it, commit it to your memory. Okay. Um, Red Mountain. In my library, I've made available two conflicting accounts of the events of Red Mountain. Uh, my own account and another false account of, uh, among the Ashlanders uh, unpreserved for the Apocrypha. 
I don't care whether you believe my account or not, I'll leave it up to you to judge which is true. Uh, my library, uh, I want your trust and your willing uh, and willing cooperation, so I've had the priest make copies of a number of documents. They're in there for you to read and take with you. Take a look at them, help yourself. Um, already covered Defeat Dagothur. Already covered Dagothur. Dagothur is the former High Council of House Dagoth. He was Lord Nerevar's, uh, he was of Lord Nerevar's generation, older than we, and the might and a mighty sorcerer and enchanted in life. In his sustained shadow of immortality, he appears to be a highly intelligent, severely deluded immortal monster with an unparalleled supernatural abilities. He appears by turns lucid and deranged, compassionate, compassionate and bestial, profoundly wise and profoundly disordered. In short, he is a mad god. Okay. So I'm guessing Battle of Red Mountain. Okay. I'm not going to bother with those. It's still very dark. Uh, let me just the settings. Any transparent seed. Must be the gamma. Okay. Right then. To Red Mountain, I guess. There is Yon Wraith Guard. So, constant effect shield 10 points. Reflect 20%, resist blight disease 50%, well I'm immune to disease, resist shock, resist fire, resist frost, resist magic, resist poison. Ka ching I lose 20 points of strength. I'll stick that on in the fight, <laughs> I think. Right. So I need to get to Ghost Gate, which means going to Alderune. It's the nearest place, I think. Uh, yeah. Actually, let's use the gondolas. That's what they're there for. But for now, I'd rather have the the twenty strength. Hello. Uh, take me to arena. Hiya, 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 hiya. And take me to the foreign quarter. And then we'll Stilt Strider to Balmora, then to Alderoon, then head to Ghost Gate. So we're getting near the end now. Go find Sunder and Keening. He didn't mark them on the map though, did he? Ah, no, he did. Right. Hello. Take me to Balmora. You fell down. You see, it, now it just seems a bit too bright. Uh, yeah, that'll do. That'll do. Okay, and if you could take me to Aldrun. And I need to go to Ghost Gate. And you know what? I'm going to. Reset you. Who are you? What are you doing here? Oh, you just want transport. You you, you, you want someone to escort you, and I, I hate that escort quest. Got me some fire bike though. Actually, 
you know, before I do this, I'm going to go to my my home, grab my Daedric Spear, and enchant it with Absorb Health. Because I imagine that once I get past Ghost, Ghost Gate, there's going to be a lot of fighting. And I'm going to want to be as tooled up as possible. So, Daedric, Enchanted Daedric Spear seems to be the way forward. I can't remember if I... Actually, did I mark it? You know what? I'm going to... Save. Cast recall. This one honors us. Please speak. No. Although I probably do need to speak to her. Alright. I think yeah. Let's go to let's go let's go to my house. You're very tanky, aren't you? Fall down now. Yeah, blighted. Of course. And you're going to want to come and pick a fight. Ah, you're a little less tanky. Right. Oh, I can see my house from here. I probably also want to go and... Right, let's, uh, let's take that. I probably also want to craft some more potions, although... I do have rather a lot. I mean, if I do... I've got all those Restore Fatigues. I've got all these Restore Healths. Uh, restore Quality, Magicka Resistance. Restore Magicka, Restore Magicka. Yeah, I've got enough Restore Magicka. I'll probably make some more though, wouldn't hurt. Okay. Then once I've, once I've gone home and made my uh, crafted spear and some... Yeah, I'll make some more Restore Magicka. You never know. Oh. Right. So yeah, probably won't be able to do uh, complete the main quest in this episode. Probably the next one, maybe the one after that, and then afterwards we'll go and do the uh, the Mournhold stuff. Okay. Into my bedroom. Where's me Daedric Spear? Right. Um, let's rest up. Make an enchanted item with Daedric Spear, Absorb Health. Oh. So ten. Oh. oh, 
Oh, no, that's... <laughs> oh, uh... Duration... No, duration one second. Charge cost two, charge 400. Cost three... That'll do. Let's make it 20. Go. And create. Right. And I can leave Stormforge be... Actually... No, I'll keep Stormforge. Uh, item will not fit. I think the other chest's full as well, isn't it? Oh, no. I can take little things. Uh... Get rid of that. Won't fit. Okay. Uh, need Wraith Guard. Keep Moon and Star. Keep Raven Eye. Don't need the Ring of the Horse Tour anymore. Don't need that. Might need fortified security. Night eyes always useful. I'm not going to be talking with anyone anymore, am I? Right. We'll close that. Got in here. This is all other daydrick stuff. I'll take out the ebony darts. They can go in there. Got uh right. Where oh where I put Okay, so I need restore magicka. Okay. Agility, restore magicka. Let's keep looking. Assist, fortify, fortify. Hmm. Okay. I could have sworn I had more than that. Got some void salt. Okay. Is this magic a restore magic? Okay, the ebony won't fit. Me won't fit. Want the yeah, that's restore magic. That's restore magic. Space for that oh, doesn't fit. That doesn't fit. All right. Okay. Ah. Oh.
Right. So... back so I don't really want to be carrying it around and that can go there right so onwards uh, oh yeah I want to drop off that medium armor Okay, can go there. Um, Adamantium Jink Blind of Wounds. I'm running out of space to put stuff. Okay, need to sell that gauntlet. <laughs> hmm. Soul gems are useful. Let's see. I suppose there's no harm in talking. But uh, you don't barter. You my attention up. Do you barter? Or are you just training? You're just training. Hello, Outlander. May I help you? What training do you offer? Long blade, athletics, and block. Okay. No, thank you. Uh, I suppose, yeah, let's arm Sivy back to uh, Aldru. I am blessed to be at your service, Outlander. Okay. So you won't train me. You don't barter. Do you barter? Yes. Right, what have we got? Uh, dispel. Belful suffering. Yeah, I'll get rid of that. Dispel's always useful. Don't really need them, but I'll keep hold of them. Flame guard could be useful. Resist frost. Don't want that. Healing's always good. Fortified personality. I don't need. Don't need. Don't need. GCs. I'll keep just in case. Uh, don't want that. To restore health, fatigue. Yep. Don't want that. Oh, we're... Yeah, they can't afford any of this. <laughs> okay. The cash is lock splitter. Max sale. Thank you. Is there something I can do for you? Probably not. Oh. Uh, now let's head up and try and sell some stuff over here. There you are. Right. So you've got a bit more money. Do you buy scrolls? It's dispel, dispel. Yes, right. Resist fire, resist frost. Oh, can't afford. You're not going to be able to afford them. You have my. Okay, let's come over here. Is there something I can do for you? Hello. All right, where were we? Let's 
fill the healing. I'll keep light just in case. Keep that. Restore health, restore magic. Yeah, we definitely want that. Swift swimming, water breathing. Ooh. That'll do. Max sail. Quickly, Outlander. I haven't much time. Okay. I think. Now. I'm pretty much locked, cocked, and ready to rock. So let's head to the ghost gate. And. Grab Soul Trap. That gorgeous new enchanted Daedric Spear. Go on, get lower. that I can't see where I am ah that's the yeah so I am at least going the right way <laughs> alright it's in ghost gate now eh? so oh the ghost fence I should say uh, I'm off to fuck up, fuck off, um, fuck up, Dagother. I'm off to fuck up, Dagother. I'm off to fuck up, Dagother. Oh! This is just silly. Absolutely silly. So, yeah. 6 to 40 base damage on a thrust with 20 points of, of health damage as well. That also heals me. <laughs> oh. And. There we go. I don't know why I'm bouncing, I don't need my strength up any foot higher. My acrobatics is pretty solid. Hmm. Oh, there you are. <laughs> I am ridiculously OP. Is my level? Level 31. We're close to leveling as well. No, no hurty the scrib. No hurty the scrib. Oh, there you are. Just silly. <laughs> About yeah, I, I I'm more full up on end game items. I mean, aside from switching my pauldrons and chest plate for uh, Daedric items. I'm about as good as you can get. Alright.
Chance skills is funny number. Right. So I just uh, take my swig of coffee. First real fight. Actually, no point in looting them, really. Um, right, uh, yes, so I do need to head this way. This way, alright. Oh. Wrong button, Chris. I probably should have left the book at home. Oh, too late now. I'm not leaving a fucking soul gem there. I've only got one, and that's Azura's. You're just going to keep following me, aren't you? That's a waste. Absorbed. Thank you. Uh, yeah. Probably not worth it anyway. races on lower thank you oh yeah I wanted to rest so I could level willpower Speed intelligence. Yeah? Intelligence is almost a hundred. I probably should have trained up block, but never mind. Well that there looks like where I need to go. At least for the first part. How are we doing for time? 20 minutes? 
Oh! <laughs> that worked out so well for you, didn't it? Stop running away from me! I don't want any of that, do I? Oh! Out of combat, yes. And hopefully, this way get me up here. No. Oh, how the shuffle am I supposed to get up there? Am I going to have to levitate? Oh, it would be so slow. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I'm managing it. I'm managing it. But it looks, look, it's a path. It's quite clearly a path. get up that way. Let's try over here. No. Ah, yeah. Come here. I'd rather chop this dude, but... Fine. Okay. And I want that. It's this way I want to go. Come on. I could really do with a better levitate, but... There has to be an easier way to get up here. You see, there's a path. Or maybe... Yeah, maybe I have to go around that side. Oh well. We're here now. Do you look like something to fight? Okay. 
Ascended Sleeper. Right. Let's recharge that. It looked like there's a door over here. There is a door over here. Nice. Alright, so I've unlocked that. Oh, he's just... He's stuck down there. He can't actually get to me because of the door. Oh, we got... Don't need our chemical stuff. Don't need any of that. Dwarven halberds. Okay. I'm going to keep using the skeleton key just for the uh, the free successes to level up security. Dagoth Odros, so I've got Amulet of Heartfire. Fortify Agility Temp, 20 points. Fortify Unarmored. Chameleon. Fortify Speed. And we'll grab the key. Six House Amulet. No. Skeletal Corpse. Oh, I'll take the gold. It doesn't weigh anything. I don't really need it, but you know. Right. So I should no longer count as being in combat. Anything good on them. This room appears to be empty. This is where apparently Sunder and Keening are, <coughs> or one of them. I need to get up there. Am I going to have to levitate up there? I think so. There doesn't seem to be any other way. Uh, do I have levitate potions? 20 it's okay, dude. I'm coming, I'm coming. I'll get your soul. Alright. Dwarven crossbow, iron bolt. Okay. It's ebony arrows, iron arrows, silver bolts, iron bolts. If you're running a marksman build War axe, Dwarven War Hammer Grab the Armourer's Hammer 
Huh. Let's, uh... Stick this on, make sure we're not missing anything. Don't even know why I picked that up. I've got no use for it. I'm immune to his disease. Okay, so it's not here. It has to be something. Okay, I'll come in here. I've got a key. Only thing I can think of. Is that. There must be another part of this area. Ah! To the tower. Keening! Okay, so, short play, constant effect, fortify magic of 50 points, fortify health 30 points, fortify attack 30 points, fortify agility 20 points, fortify speed. Right, anything else in here? Ash statues. No, don't care. Right. Time for us to go. Okay. So next, I need to get to Veminor. I'll do. Aha! A path! <laughs> I'm guessing this just goes round. Okay, enchant skills up. looking on the next level up so intelligence so I could max that out I would like to max out my agility but I think I'm going to have to wait until I've uh, finished everything or at least finish the main quest Onwards. So hopefully I can go around the uh, the edge of the uh, ghost fence. I see you, Ash Save. Let's just keep following the path, shall we? Okay, come on. Don't want to aggro the shawl. No, I want to aggro the shawl. We got a hunger. Come here. Come here. I 
are we looking for time? Oh, we're all right. I suppose actually, I should uh, do some repairs. That an Ogrim? That's an Ogrim! Oh no! However will I cope? I'm going to have to go all the way around the long way, aren't I? Unless... Actually, I don't mind going around the long way. Because I'm getting to kill things, I'm working on my uh, mysticism, I'm working on my enchant skill. Get my intelligence and willpower up. we go. Oh, we have a tomb. I love how those things always used to be a threat, now they're just a mild inconvenience. Alright, so looking at the time, what I think I'll do. <laughs> Salve our ancestral tombs. I think I will take a rest here. And I will call it an episode. So, as always, I want to thank everyone for watching. You know how YouTube works. 